have to see moving. You can't always just read a book or look at a picture. The 2 p.m. Sunday showing of Selma at the Nickelodeon Theater was sold out, and taking up most of the seats were students at Voorhees College. Autumn Woods was one of them. Seeing this movie really showed me how my ancestors and people that came before me, even my mother and my grandfather, how they fought and how I should be appreciative. The students were able to attend the showing for free through a financial gift from their alumni association. After the film ended, the audience was able to get a historical perspective, even though panelist Dr. Todd Shaw says there's a lot of modern day parallels. I see Ferguson in this film. I see what happened with Eric Gardner uh, in New York in this film. I think the, the, in some ways, uh, DuVernay as the director was looking through a 21st century lens a little bit backwards and to that point to make it con to, con to connect the two. The main focus of the movie was Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and others tackling the voting rights for blacks in Selma, which Shaw says still persists as an important issue. That epic 1965 Voting Rights Act is the very act that's under attack today. And so the issue does not go away. The fight doesn't go away. We're still willing to fight these battles. That shows that it's something that's present in the people, in the blood, in, the, in just the genealogy and the history of an individual. Many in the audience appreciated hearing the perspective of experts in the field, but Shaw says it's the talks among the community that are most important. The conversations that matter most are those between folk who aren't sort of the scholars, who have their own takeaway. You know, that's the most important knowledge is what, it, is what uh, all of us ordinary day folk take away from it um, and, and see in it that inspires us.